Oh, <laughs> I didn't get that. Didn't? Her, na her name is Marie. So Marie, Marie Calendars. Calendars. That's a joke. I just oh my made god. Up. Let's get a venti ice water. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. So I am leaving Starbucks right now and it's like freezing cold. I got off about an hour ago. Sorry, my voice is really terrible because I'm still kind of sick. But I got off about an hour ago and um, I decided to stay and get some like wedding stuff done because we don't have internet until like Monday. So I was like, okay, I'll just come here and get some um, wedding planning stuff done, get some addresses down. So that's what I did. Um, now I'm gonna head home because I'm starving. And then I think Bronson and I are going to do a fiance like Q&A for you guys. So yeah, let's go because I'm freaking freezing. Do you guys think I can make it home? I think I can make it home. No, I think I'll stop and get some gas actually. <laughs> So I'm the only one at this gas station right now. Not gonna lie, it's just a little bit sketchy. And it's dark outside, even though it's like only seven o'clock at night. Okay, so I just got home and I just got done eating dinner. Bronson and I are going to finish watching Stomp the Yard. You heard that right. We're watching Stomp the Yard, which is Bronson's favorite movie, may I add. And he also mentioned that when he first watched it, when he was 12 years old, he decided that he wanted to be a dancer. Anyway, so I'm going to make myself some hot cocoa because I have still yet to warm up. And then we're going to finish watching the movie and then we will do the Q&A with you guys. So, okay guys. So I thought we'd come on here and answer some questions for you guys. That way you guys can kind of get to know us. Bronson absolutely hates being on camera, may I add. So you guys are really... Typing in front of it, behind it. <laughs> he hates anything with it. to do with cameras. By the way, sorry about my voice. I am... They don't forgive you. Kind of getting sick, so... Um, if I sound funny or stuffy, that's just how I am, so just deal with it. First question, when and where did we meet? Don't know. I was too young, I think, to care yeah. about when anything was. We've known each other for... A while. A long time. So 13? Mm hmm 13 years. 13 years. Ish. Ish. Um, 13... And we met at church. Years. Church. Yeah, church. When was our first date? Um, that's a really good question. I don't even remember. I think our, I think our technical first date was at Takano's. No, nope, not Takano's. Uh, what is that place called? Carino's. Johnny Carino's. That's what it was. Johnny Carino's in Twin Falls. Mm -hmm. Um, cause Bronson used to come to visit me. Like he used to make the two and a half, almost three hour drive to come and visit me. Um, yeah. Who said I love you first? Me. 100% me. When is my birthday? So bad with dates, you guys. Like, he does not remember. Like, I don't expect him to remember my birthday because he's so bad at this. But to be fair, I'm not 100%. This is so embarrassing. Do we even love each other? No. No, no we don't, apparently. Yours is June something. Yes. Sixth. No. I always say sixth. Why do I it's say sixth? It's because the month is six. Six times eight, 48. I will never remember that ever again. <laughs> June 8th. Uh, and your birthday's December 21st? Mm -hmm. Yes. See, I'm, I'm a good girlfriend. Where was I born? Where were you born? Yeah, and where were you born? You were born in Hawaii. I was born on the, in the ocean. In what the, state? Little Mexico. No! Tell me it's not. Comment down below if 
Riverside, California is <laughs> Little Mexico. Oh my gosh. I was born in Riverside, California. I don't know rules. Uh, what color are my eyes? Birds are like green, like a hazel green, sometimes like a light brown. Mine are brown, dark brown, not quite black, but really dark. Which food do I love? Otino's pizzas. <laughs> you love everything. Everything. Tuna is one of your favorites. Well, I like fish in general. Yeah, fish. What's one food that I hate? You hate, you hate mushrooms. You despise them. They're worse. He than... hates. Well, mushrooms. I don't know if it's a food, but you don't like cilantro. I don't. I don't like cilantro. Which makes me want to. Like, I don't like cilantro. I think it's so gross. Cat. Okay, this is a good question. You're sitting in front of a TV. What are you watching? What are you watching? Yeah, what am I watching? You're watching a dumb girly girly show. Yeah, but like has if, doctors if, in it. No, if I'm one. no, if I'm watching Netflix, what's like my go-to favorite? The 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 good no, doctor one. No, no. What's my favorite show on Netflix? Scandal. I love Scandal. Like I absolutely. Before it's love not Scandal. the worst show in the world. It's just like it's not a little the, too much. Okay, it's the best show in the world. You're probably watching not wa myself play video. Yeah, games. I was gonna say you're probably not watching anything. You're <laughs> playing video games. It's faster. What's my weirdest habit? This is a good one because I don't know. I don't know what my weirdest. I know your weirdest habit. Your weirdest habit <laughs> is you have like a habit of always eating Totino's pizza. No, like legitimate. <laughs> What's my weirdest habit? I don't know. I thought you would say something about me leaving cups everywhere. Like cups of not drinking coffee. That was a trap. <laughs> His weirdest habit, I feel oh, like, weirdest. is like leaving clothes where they don't belong. Like They belong where I leave them. No. Clothes like... In the I don't know, like on our island, like in the kitchen. Yeah, there's. He a, just has a pile of clothes. There's like, a jersey and a jacket and a shirt right there. Yeah. What am I good at? What's one thing I'm really good at? I know what you're good at. Like singing or like. Did you pick yourself? You're bleeding. Cooking certain things. She's really good at cooking certain things. Certain things. I would say you're really good at. I would say cooking. Like I feel like you're better than me at cooking. Okay, what am I really bad at then? Cooking certain things. Um, I'm good at cooking certain things, but I feel like I'm really bad at cooking certain things. What, what are you really bad at? Uh, folding clothes. Like, just shove them and yank them out when you need them. so bad at folding clothes, it's ridiculous. What sport do I like most? The most boring, the one you run on a square. I do love baseball, I love baseball. Yours is basketball. What do you say that? Yours is basketball. I'm making a sandwich, what's on it? A sandwich? Yours is tuna. That's true, because I don't like sandwiches. Yours would be like any meat that we have inside of the fridge. Like, it doesn't matter. You're not picky. He just grabs things. <laughs> um, you just make a, a sandwich out of anything. A tiny little bit of mustard. Like a hamburger is just a, a bigger tiny sandwich. tiny little bit of mayo. No, I love mustard. There's no mayonnaise on my sandwich. What is wrong with you as a person? You say just like a little tiny mm -hmm. bit of mayo. I, I love the mustard and zero mayonnaise. It honestly just depends on what's in the fridge. That's true. If I could, what candy could I eat all day long? Rephrase that question. I, if I could, what candy would could I eat all day long? What candy would I eat all day long? And Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> eat that till my teeth fall out. Yeah, no, he really Hers didn't. is uh, Sour Skittles. Skittles. If I could live anywhere in the world, where would I live? Hawaii. <laughs> anywhere where people aren't there. That's true. And there is an ocean. <laughs> anywhere where people aren't there and there's an ocean. No, because I like people. I genuinely do. And anywhere that he could get good raw fish. That's true. To complete that sentence, my girlfriend slash boyfriend is annoying. Yeah, I was going to say annoying. Unfiltered. I would say my, like, my boyfriend is very unfiltered. Not so much anymore. I don't know. That's a tough question. Karina is... Because I know you can't do blanket statements. I'm very bad at those. Like, just like saying, like, someone is just this. Like, All but in this moment, I am what? What? Karina is forcing me to do a video. <laughs> What's my middle name? Kaimana, which is a Hawaiian name, which means. I say diamond. Diamond. Kaimana. Uh, yours is um, calendars. No. Oh, <laughs> I didn't get that.
She didn't. Her, her real name is Marie. Marie, Marie Callenders. Callenders. That's a joke. I just oh my made gosh. Up. How do I drink my coffee and or tea? Black. He loves his coffee like black or like really strong. Like he likes a little bit of flavor, but yeah, he if likes I could just really, have like really, really like the reason like why I put mud any water. part of creamer in there is like just to like get a flavor. So it's like I would have coffee with like a flavored syrup would be great. Yeah. And you me? like yours ninety percent sugar and milk. But I've changed a little bit. I can drink black coffee. Just because you can do it, it says what you like, not oh. what you can do. Yeah. What's my favorite video game? Hers is none. She hates them. That's all. not true. I do have a favorite video game. Oh, a video game? Yeah. Name it. I'm making... Oh, Pac Man. <laughs> you go buy me a Pac Man game? Mario Kart. I do like Mario Kart, except That's it brings out the worst in me. You know when you're bad at something, but you think you're good? <laughs> I don't th even think I'm good at it. You know when I you're bad at something? <laughs> <laughs> His is pretty much anything basketball related. No, I, like, I like video games in general. Like, I like Mario yeah. Kart. Like, oh, yeah. My brother does. bought me Assassin's Creed, which is dope. Um, see, she likes no video games. <laughs> I, I don't. I think video games are a waste of space in your mind and energy and time. Oh, I like this one. What do we usually argue about? <laughs> I don't know. What do we usually argue about? Um, I would say ridiculous things that like aren't even serious. Yeah, because most of, I don't know. I think most people are generally like good at, what's the word I'm looking for? Like governing themselves. I don't know. Who usually wins our arguments? Ah, uh, me. <laughs> me. That's what I said the same thing you said. <laughs> me. Me. How long do I need in the morning to get ready? All. All of it. <laughs> all of it. I would say depending on whether or not you have to shower. No, no, no. It's 15. depending on whether or not like she has to wake up earlier or no, not. No, no. I'm talking about you. Oh, me? If you have to shower like 20 minutes. No, 30 minutes. If you have to like not shower, I would say like 15. Okay. Am I a morning person or a night person? What do you call a person that's in between? <laughs> she likes to go to sleep early and wake up late. So she's like a, like an afternoon person or like a person that just, just likes to sleep. Uh, he's like, what do you call someone who's just like an every, all day person? The type of person that you see and is like, oh, that's too much in the morning. Oh, that's too much in the afternoon. Oh, that's Whoa, too much all the time. he needs to go to time. bed right now. <laughs> no, it's just that's too much all the time. That's possible. <laughs> if you could change anything about me, what would it be? Nothing. And that is a safe <laughs> answer. <laughs> um, <laughs> what celebrity would you love to meet the most? Celebrity? That's tough. Love I don't know, like... James. No, well, I mean, it would depend on what context. So you're just thinking, like, just, like, hanging out with for, like... Amount of time, like talking LeBron, to LeBron James, no. KB, NF, Lecrae. He would like to just sit there and pick his brain. Mm -mm -mm. I said I really would love to see Lecrae speak. Speak. You would like to pick. I would NF. like to really talk to KB. I'd like to share experiences with yeah. NF and LeBron James. I'd like to see, like, kind of just talk life with him as well. Yeah. What about me? Jacqueline Hill. That's true. I absolutely love Jaclyn Hill. Like, I have every single one of her things that she's ever collabed with. So, hashtag Jaclyn Hill's like a babe. She's seriously like so amazing. Like, I don't, I don't understand. She's perfect. Not perfect, but. Nobody's perfect. I gotta work it. Okay, last one. If I was an animal, which one would I be? You, a cat. <laughs> Like, what do they mean? Like, which one would you want to be? Or which no, one, which like, one, like, like which one, like, yeah, my trait? spirit animal. Oh, that, ah. Um, if you were an animal, you'd be a monkey, for sure. You'd be a monkey. I was born in the year of the monkey. Or like a gorilla. Not like a gorilla, because you're not big fat. enough. No, you're not big enough to be a gorilla. Nah. The red ones that have, like, the big... <laughs> Those are orangutans. Orangutans! Like... <laughs> before that makes sense, because it's... They don't know what to do with their body, it seems like, and that makes sense. What about me? Uh, shit. Like a dove or something like that. Why? A Why? dove? Why? You're like a swan. Like something that, like it has to be a bird. Why? I hate birds so much. Why like a dove or, I feel like those are like really like majestical, like oh, peaceful, no. elegant, it's graceful. Cause, it's cause when you try to go go chase after them, they fly away. I don't know how to explain my thoughts, it's just that's what it goes to. <laughs> Cause I think of like pure, or like, innocent, when I think of a dove or a swan. 
Because they're not like, like you don't think of them as like aggressive animals. This was like a deep question that I am not prepared for. <laughs> How is seconds. this deep? I literally just asked you what animal I would be. And I said swan. But then, why? Because you're like a swan. <laughs> I can't do this. So. so stop. I hate, I hate when, when you, you do this. this. Stop. stop. Anyways, Anyways, so that's so all that I have for today's day. video. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Vlogmas Day videos. And also, tomorrow night at 10 p.m. is when the giveaway from yesterday's Vlogmas ends. So you don't want to miss out on that. Go ahead and check out yesterday's Vlogmas if you want to know all the details on how to win for that giveaway it's gonna be awesome it's like an $80 value so you really don't want to miss out that's pretty much all for today thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this Q&A okay bye guys